everybody and welcome to Alaska Family Vlogs. Today I'm going to show you how to make a super simple dessert and it's only two ingredients and the best part is it is absolutely healthy. So it's banana ice cream and when I first heard about banana ice cream I actually thought it was going to be terrible, I was going to hate it, but it is so good. Now I eat it for breakfast very often, and if you're like my brothers who like eggs for breakfast, then you can eat it for second breakfast, which is what they do all the time. Anyways, there's a brother <laughs> right there. So all you will need are two ripe, really ripe bananas, some frozen bananas, some kind of blender, and some kind of milk. I'm using unsweetened almond milk. It's super simple. You just take the, the non-frozen bananas, put them in the bottom of the blender. And then I usually do one raw banana to about three frozen bananas and the reason I put a raw banana in um, not frozen is because it is usually really hard on the blender um, and you have to add water or a lot of water or milk which makes it really watery and not creamy and I like it really creamy so I usually add one raw banana to three frozen bananas and about two tablespoons of your preferred milk and then you just blend. Now here you can also add vanilla, you can add cocoa powder, you could add any kind of flavoring that you want. I'm just going to do it bananas and then I'll add some toppings after I blend it. So here's the final product, really creamy and thick and absolutely delicious. And what I'm going to add on top of this here is some chopped pecans, some cacao nibs, which are super good if you've never tried them and drizzle a little bit of peanut butter and I actually like to drizzle the peanut butter on rather than mix it in because it it freezes into these delicious little peanut buttery chunks so I'm gonna go ahead and do that now so I use organic all-natural creamy uh, peanut butter and so it's kind of uh, liquidy and I just drizzle it on top and then add the cacao nibs as many as you like so you give it a nice crunch and also a chocolatey flavor that I really really like and they're supposed to be really really good for you as well and then last but not least chopped pecans now I normally add walnuts but we are out right now and really you can add any kind of nut that you prefer macadamia almonds um, you can also add some berries if you like or even granola is really good but I like to eat it just like this. There we go. So anyways, it's as simple as that. I hope you like it and I really hope you try it. If you do, leave a comment below and tell me right. what you thought and what other recipes I should try next. Mm -hmm. 